subscribe our channel for daily technology and smartphone videos hello friends welcome to my youtube channel and today oneplus has released a new open beta 6 update for the oneplus 5t device and still it's open beta 6 and not a stable version and they have added few more features in the open beta 6 with april security patch set update so in the coming section of this video we will see all the features which uh, how to install open beta 6 on over the stable version and what are the changes in, involved in this particular open beta 6 but sadly there is no stable version and i guess it's more than one month it's almost one and a half month and still there is no stable version rollout by the oneplus for the oneplus 5d users and oneplus 5d phone is still running on the december security patch set update whereas the open beta s6 is launched in the april security patch set update so somewhere oneplus needs to improve this uh, their update for the stable version maybe it's because of the oneplus 6 launch which will schedule on in the next month because of that because oneplus 6 will launch in android 8.1 so because of this particular uh, issue they might be thinking that uh, they will roll out this particular uh, stable update for the oneplus 5t lately after the oneplus 6 launch but nevertheless let's see what are the new changes in the open beta 6 version so without any further delay let's get started So guys, this is from the OnePlus community application where they says that the Open Beta 6 for the OnePlus 5D has been launched almost 19 hours ago. And uh, as you can see, the earphone mode has been added over here. OnePlus clock has been changed, card package and uh, April security patch level update. So these are the few change log for the Open Beta 6 version. So I will quickly show you how to download this particular Open Beta. If you are on stable version, you will need to download complete ROM. Just type OnePlus 5D download and you will directly go to the OnePlus website over here from this you will see the first option uh, as is today's date open beta 6 as you can see this is 1.61 gb and you can directly download from here you will find download option over here so you can directly download this particular build from here or else if you are already on open beta 5 then you can you will directly get open beta 6 incremental ota update on your mobile via opera vpn method or anything else so i have already downloaded this file so i will show you how to install it over the stable version let me show you my stable version so as you can see this is my stable version 5.0.4 and it's still on december security patch level update so i will let you know how to install this quickly so let me reboot this in the recovery mode so So now I am in the recovery mode, let us enter password over here. It will decrypt your phone, choose English, install from internal storage, before that wipe cache over here, done, install from internal storage. Now go to your download folder and this is the oneplus 5t open beta 6 zip file, just tap and install. It will take couple of minutes to complete the installation process. After a couple of minutes, it will say install success, yes, again go to wipe return cache, wipe cache, yes, reboot. Now it will take couple of minutes to complete the reboot process. So the device reboot has been completed and let me show you the current version. So as you can see, it's open beta 6, 8.1 Android version and April security patch set level. So it uh, security patch level has been upgraded to April, which is the latest one. Besides that, I will show you what are the new changes involved in this particular open beta 6 version. But before that, go to the storage option and see if there is a junk file enabled. And as you can see, there is a 470 MB of cache data. So let's delete this cache data as well. And now I will let you know what are the new changes in this open beta 6. Change log is they have added earphone mode. I guess they have added the earphone mode in open beta 5 itself, but they have, might be they have added some new features. So let's go to the settings. Let me go to the settings over here. And then go to sounds and vibration. Here I found some new options like a default volume to adjust by using volume button. You want a ringtone volume or a volume media volume. Again, do not disturb preference has been added over here. And earphone mode here is it earphone mode and when you see this earphone mode you will find auto play option that's mean uh, you can automatically resume uh, your playback music when you connect the earphone normally what happen when you connect the earphone the music gets paused 
but then it will resume the music in this particular section if you enable this. Again the caller information will be broadcasted via earphone. This is one more uh, new feature and the notification ringtones will be listened through the earphones. And this is a Bluetooth absolute volume that means it will auto sync your headset and the device when it is connected to the Bluetooth. So this is a new mode earphone mode they have mentioned over here. I guess it's already there in open beta 5 but not sure if I have missed this. But in this open beta 6 they have mentioned the earphone mode for the this particular issue. And apart from this I don't find anything new in the sounds and vibration section. Again in the second change log uh, they have says that the OnePlus clock they have some added some new UI and the stopwatch uh, UI and alarm background. So again this is uh, as of now no use I mean this is a OnePlus clock and it's similar I don't find any new information over here it's almost similar. So in again this is a stopwatch I don't find anything new over here. So I don't know what they are trying to mean over here that the stopwatch has been new UI has been added. And the third uh, this particular change log is the card package and they said that they have added a membership card in shelf. So this is a OnePlus uh, launcher and if you go over here you will find membership card. If you tap over here there is a membership card option over here and you can add your membership cards here. They have provided the guideline that if you have any membership card you can just scan those membership card and you don't need to physically carry the membership cards like what we use in the Android Pay or Samsung Pay, it's a similar method for the membership cards. So you can just please uh, enter the manually and you can add the merchant name, card number and all these things so that you can actually add the membership card over here and then you can use it. But uh, so they may add me if you are a member of any club or if you are a member of any uh, mall like a shopping mall or something like that then you can you, like a shop stop or pantaloons. Then you don't need to carry their membership card each and every time. You just enter this membership details over here and just carry your phone and all the membership cards and the QR, QR barcode will be displayed over there. And apart from this they have said that the April security patch level updated. So we have already seen that they have added April security patch level. Let me show you again. So as you can see the Android patch security patch level is April 2018. So these are the only new changes involved in this open beta 6 version for the OnePlus 5T device. I don't know why they are not providing the stable version for the OnePlus 5T like a navigation gestures. I am still using this uh, particular uh, navigation bar but you can actually disable this navigation bar by going into the uh, gesture buttons option and then navigation bars and this and then navigation gestures and that's it. So you can actually easily use this quite a nice feature. I actually like this feature a lot. I don't know when they will provide this in the stable version. At least they can provide the navigation gestures update for the OnePlus 5T users in the stable ROM and after OnePlus 6 launch they can provide 8.1 update to the OnePlus 5T. So that uh, it will be the good and fair enough with the OnePlus 5T users but I don't know what OnePlus is doing over here. So guys that's it for today's video and I hope you like this particular video. If you like this video please hit like and subscribe to our channel. We will see in the next upcoming video with more such type of video. Till then thank you very much and see you soon.